Day came with 33 points and 10 rebounds. In the center, we have head coach Jim Walker. And on the right, Vaughn Austin, 19 points, three boards, and four assists today. Uh, coach, let's start with some general comments on the game and the result. Uh, you know, again, another hard fought battle between West Texas and Commerce. It, it was. Uh, it was what we expected. We knew it'd be a, be a high scoring game. Uh, these two guys combined to, uh, to have 17 field goals in the game and 16 of them came in the second half. So uh, I, I thought they really carried us and uh, really kept us in the game. We, we, they, were, they were hard to stop on, on their end and, and, and we were hard to stop on the other end. And uh, I think we just kind of got a slow start as far as putting the ball in the bucket. Javon, uh, what was the message at halftime after uh, trailing by 19 in a tough first half, but a great comeback effort? Just, I mean, fight is what we've been doing all year. I mean, they got up by 19. We just think we, should, we get up 20 the next half. So just stop, don't stop fighting, really. Malik, uh, you just kept shooting and shooting, getting the line, getting the line, attacking. Was that the mentality for the entire game, or was there a switch in between the first and the second half? Um, <clears throat> I came out flat. Uh, Coach Walker is just told me at halftime they're going to lean on me to keep being aggressive. And that's what I did. I tried to win one another. Coach, talk a little bit about the, the fight back. Uh, what was the mentality you saw from the team in the locker room? Uh, I mean, it was no different than it's been all year. I just, you, you know, when you get to the to the end of the season, whether it's a conference tournament or whether you're in the NCAAs, um, you get to this interview process and you want to talk about the game, but it's really more, really more about the journey. Uh, these guys, through every game we played, have not not disappointed us in how hard they have, uh, how hard they fought in the game. But but I've been extremely impressed with with our senior leadership and, and really impressed with uh, how much sacrifice they have for each other. So it, it, it wasn't surprising. It wasn't it wasn't really any sense of urgency at halftime, except for I, I told Leek and Javon. I said you're going to shoot the same amount of shots. You're probably going to shoot more. We're going to rely on on you guys. And I, and I put. Uh, uh, Trey Seymour and, and uh, DeAndre Carson right in that. The, those four seniors have carried us all year, and we're going to live and die with, with how they play. And I'm, I'm, I'm just really proud as a, as a coach that I, I was able to be a part of, of a great experience of, of being able to coach those guys. And to Malik and Javon, talk a little bit about how this team came together to, to get to this point for, throughout the year. It's a lot of hard work. Hard work bring you together for real. I mean, just all the battles we've been through, fights, all that just bring you together. It's like a family. Yeah, piggyback on that. We've been through a lot this season, like locker room stuff. And for us to make it to the national tournament, I think that was a big accomplishment for the for the institution, just in general. Any other questions for the guys? Uh, you guys got it down to six, man. Uh, you know, in a hurry. Uh, the first five minutes of the second half, and uh, Quaid seemed to kind of be on his game today. Can you can you talk on that, Coach? What? Quaid? Well, and, and we want to give them all, all the credit in the world. I think they're a great basketball team. They can really score points. They they are efficient in how they play. What what an efficient game that you know we only had seven turnovers in the game with with that many possessions. Um, Dorian Armstrong is a is a big part of what we do defensively. He's kind of our, our inside defensive player. We get on to him a lot about not working hard enough on the offensive end. He works so hard on the defensive end. I thought uh, I thought Tom and his bunch did a great job of attacking us on the inside where we, we didn't have that defensive strength. And in the end, that really turned out to be the difference in the game. Any other questions from Coach Walker or the guys? All right. Thank you very much. Thank you.